Welcome back to Smart Simplified Channel. Today, we're going to talk about silent money moves, the kind of financial decisions you make behind the scenes that quietly build wealth and security over time. These aren't flashy, they're not talked about much, but they are incredibly powerful. In a world where everyone seems to be chasing the next big thing or posting their wins online, it's important to remember that real wealth is often built quietly, in the background, while no one is watching. These silent money moves are the foundation for long-term financial success. They might seem small or insignificant in the moment, but over time, they compound into something truly substantial. All right, let's dive right into the first silent money move. Maximizing your retirement accounts. Time is your greatest asset when it comes to investing, and the sooner you start, the more you benefit from the power of compound growth. Think of it like this. Every dollar you contribute to your retirement account today has the potential to multiply exponentially over the years. Whether you're investing in a 401k, a Roth IRA, a traditional IRA, or any other retirement vehicle, maxing out these accounts should be your top priority. The tax advantages alone are huge and the potential for growth is unmatched. Plus, many employers offer matching contributions, which is essentially free money. Don't leave that on the table. Now I know what you might be thinking, but Graham, I have other financial goals right now. I wanna travel, buy a house, maybe even start my own business. And those are all amazing goals. But here's the thing, you can work towards those goals while still prioritizing your retirement savings. Even if you can only contribute a small amount each month, it's crucial to start somewhere. You can always increase your contributions as your income grows. Remember, even small, consistent contributions can lead to big results over time. Think of your retirement contributions as paying your future self first. It's an investment in your financial freedom and security down the road. You'll thank yourself later. Let's talk about the second silent money move, which is all about taking the thinking out of saving automating your savings. This is one of the easiest and most effective ways to effortlessly build wealth over time. We're creatures of habit, and if we have to manually transfer money to savings each month, it's easy to forget or prioritize other things. Here's how it works. You set up an automatic transfer from your checking account to your savings or investment accounts each month. This way, the money is automatically moved before you even have a chance to spend it. You can think of it as paying yourself first. The key here is to be consistent. Even if you can only afford to automate a small amount each month, do it. Over time, those small amounts add up, especially as you increase your income and can afford to save more. Automating your savings takes the emotion out of saving. You don't have to think about it. You don't have to worry about it. It just happens in the background. It's like setting your finances on autopilot. Many banks allow you to set up automatic transfers within their online banking platforms. You can even set up automatic investments into your brokerage account. By automating your savings, you're essentially tricking yourself into saving more money without even realizing it. It becomes a non-negotiable part of your financial routine. Now let's move on to the third silent money move, investing in low-cost index funds. This is one of the most powerful ways to build wealth over the long term. Now I know what you might be thinking. Investing? That sounds complicated and risky, but it doesn't have to be. In fact, it can be surprisingly simple and straightforward, especially when you focus on low-cost index funds. Let me explain. An index fund is a type of mutual fund or ETF that tracks a specific market index like the S&P 500 or the Dow Jones Industrial Average. Instead of trying to pick individual stocks, which is time-consuming and risky, you're essentially buying a small piece of the entire market. This diversification is key to minimizing risk, and when we say low cost, we mean it. These funds have super low expense ratios, meaning you're keeping more of your returns. Over time, those small fees can eat into your profits, so it's crucial to choose funds with minimal expenses. You don't need to be a stock market expert or spend hours researching individual companies. Simply choose a reputable index fund that aligns with your investment goals and risk tolerance and let it do its thing. By consistently investing in low-cost index funds, you're setting yourself up for long-term financial success. The fourth silent money move we're going to discuss is all about preparing for the unexpected, building and maintaining an emergency fund. This might not sound as exciting as investing or early retirement, but trust me, 
It's one of the most important financial moves you can make. Life throws curveballs, your car breaks down, you face unexpected medical bills, or you lose your job. These events can be incredibly stressful, especially if you don't have the financial cushion to handle them. That's where your emergency fund comes in. An emergency fund is your financial safety net. It's a separate savings account specifically designed to cover unexpected expenses, allowing you to navigate those tough times without going into debt. Aim to save at least three to six months worth of living expenses in your emergency fund. Building an emergency fund isn't about deprivation, it's about peace of mind. Knowing you have a financial safety net gives you the freedom to take calculated risks, pursue your goals, and navigate life's uncertainties with confidence. Let's talk about the fifth silent money move, which is all about freeing yourself from the burden of debt, aggressively paying down high interest debt. Debt can be a major obstacle to building wealth, especially if you're stuck in a cycle of making minimum payments and accruing high interest charges. The key here is to focus on high interest debt first, such as credit card debt or payday loans. These types of debt can quickly spiral out of control due to their exorbitant interest rates. Make it your mission to eliminate these debts as quickly as possible. There are several strategies you can use to tackle your debt such as the debt snowball method or the debt avalanche method. The debt snowball method involves paying off your smallest debts first to gain momentum, while the debt avalanche method focuses on paying off your highest interest debts first to save money on interest charges. Consider consolidating your debt with a lower interest personal loan or balance transfer credit card. This can simplify your payments and potentially save you money on interest. Paying down debt takes discipline and commitment, but the rewards are well worth it. Imagine the feeling of being debt-free, of not having those monthly payments hanging over your head. Let's move on to the sixth silent money move, improving your credit score. Your credit score might seem like an abstract number, but it plays a huge role in your financial life. It can impact everything from the interest rates you qualify for on loans to whether you're approved for an apartment or even a job. Now building good credit takes time and effort, but it's an essential part of building a solid financial foundation. Start by checking your credit report regularly for any errors or inaccuracies. You can access your credit report for free from each of the three major credit bureaus, Equifax, Experian, and TransUnion. Make sure you're paying all of your bills on time, including your rent, utilities, and credit card bills. Payment history is one of the most significant factors in your credit score. Set up automatic payments or reminders to ensure you never miss a due date. Keep your credit utilization low. This refers to the amount of credit you're using compared to your total available credit. Aim to keep your credit utilization below 30%. By taking these steps, you can gradually improve your score and unlock better financial opportunities. And finally, let's talk about the seventh silent money move maintaining financial privacy. In today's social media obsessed world, it's easy to get caught up in the comparison game. We see people constantly flaunting their latest purchases, vacations, and financial successes online, which can create a sense of pressure to keep up with the Joneses. But here's the thing. True wealth is built quietly behind the scenes. It's about making smart financial decisions, staying disciplined and focusing on your own goals, not on what others are doing or saying. Maintaining financial privacy is about protecting yourself and your assets. It's about being mindful of what you share online and offline, and it's about being cautious about who you trust with your financial information. Avoid oversharing on social media. Don't brag about your income, your investments, or your expensive purchases. The more you share publicly, the more vulnerable you become to scams, identity theft, and even jealousy or resentment from others. Be wary of who you trust with your financial information. Only share your financial details with reputable financial advisors, institutions, and individuals you trust implicitly. Focus on building a secure and prosperous future for yourself and your loved ones, and let that be your silent testament to your financial success. That's a wrap on silent money moves. So to recap, the silent money moves you should be making are 1. Maximize your retirement accounts. 2. Automate your savings. 3. Invest in low-cost index funds. 4. Build an emergency fund. 5. Pay down high-interest debt. 6. Improve your credit score. And 7. Maintain financial privacy. If you found value in this video, 
hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and drop a comment below on which silent money move you're going to focus on next. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.